y'all it's your girl tamara so today as you can see by the thumbnail and the title we're gonna be doing something a little crazy something a little different besides the brows though because i usually normally do my own brows and i always do this strategy we are going to be doing faux freckles now my dark skinned ladies out there it's a good thing y'all clicked on this video because we in this together we really gonna see how these results are gonna turn out so i can only hope for the best but right now i'm gonna go over the tools and things you guys will need so you want to start off with your little um you know your little eyebrow shaper thing or whatever i think you're going to be using this to apply the um men beer dye to the brows you guys will see what i'm talking about when we get into the video you're going to need um one of your eyebrow pencils or whatever you use to outline your brows when you normally do it with makeup you are going to need your men beard dyes and normally i would be using the um regular like body cream nair but my sister put me on to the face cream yep because before we used to always use the body cream around our eyebrows would um well after a while because it would kind of like i want to say burn probably because we wasn't supposed to be putting that on our face it wasn't nothing major though that we couldn't bear or that looked crazy you know just a little um irritation so we're gonna jump right into that video before we do make sure y'all hit that thumbs up button make sure y'all leave a comment below and make sure y'all subscribe to my channel all right y'all so this is what i'm working with as you can see the brows are already drawn and outlined what you're gonna do is just brush that hair upwards because that's going to be the hair that's getting waxed. The hair that's necessarily not in shape. Basically. Okay guys, so now we're going to go in with our nair. And when we go in with our nair, we're going to be using just, you know, a good little amount. Put it on a flat surface, piece of paper, whatever you got accessible. You want to use that eyebrow makeup brush or whatever is um, best for you to outline with that you use to outline with whether that be brows or you know now when you do this part you want to make sure you try not to get any ears because when you ask you ask and whatever the near is on is the hair is gone <laughs> so be really careful be really precise One time. First of all, I left this one for about, I'm not even gonna lie. The tube says five minutes, but your girl did it for like 10. So, cause I just wanna, you know, make sure everything is precise. And if it's, as they say, for face, it shouldn't, you know, burn. So, you want to use a washcloth, napkin, makeup remover, whatever you want. I got a little piece of paper here and I'm going to damp it with some warm water and just wipe that off. And we're going to start with the eyebrow that we waxed, um, we, we did first. I think I did too much. I took the tail off, but don't worry, because when we go in with that tint, y'all gonna look like y'all just got your brows microbladed. Okay. All right, because y'all see it. So I think I'm going to actually continue the brow tinting and the faux freckles on my phone because my camera looking like it's going to die on me right now. So I'm going to be back to y'all in the next clip. So um, shout out to iPhone 11 because this is going to be shot on iPhone 11. So if y'all like this footage, if this footage come out smooth like my camera, Apple might have just did their thing. You're going to have your beard dye. 
I think it's the developer and the die in both tubes. You're going to just score an even amount. Um, normally, I wouldn't do this much, but because I said I'm going to be trying the whole fox freckles thing and my eyebrows, I did this much. And you're just going to mix it together. It's really simple. You want to just go in with your um, Vaseline. I use, uh, um, you know, those, those things that you clean your ears with. My body not working correct at the time. Don't come for me and my vocab. But I use those things that you clean your ears with just to put it on. But now I'm using what I got. So I had already finished one brow, but you just want to start at the tail of the brow and increasingly add on the product until you get to the front. Let's try this out. I want to say it's probably been five minutes now. So I'm gonna leave them on for a good more 10. <laughs> and then we'll come back and wipe them off. So oh guys, I just wet this um makeup wipe that I had. And I'm just gonna wipe my brows off and these freckles and let's see. Unraveling time. Oh god, y'all hear my stomach? I'm about to go find something to eat right now. So this is how it came out y'all, let's get on to the freckles. Regardless of how these turn out, I feel like once you a clean person and you wash your face every night and day, it will start to fade and come off. So, no stress. And like I said, <laughs> where are we going? Nowhere. Quarantine got us stuck. So, this is how my brows look. This is how my freckles look. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you guys like the results. You guys can definitely try them um, on yourselves at home. And they might even come out better than mine. <laughs> but make sure y'all leave some love in the comments. Hit that subscribe button. And give this video a thumbs up if I put y'all on. Or if y'all just like the video. And thank you again for watching. You made me hustle. I thank you. I thank you.